we're gonna go to this festival, which is today. We thought the festival was gonna be in the Frankfurt Square. Because I saw an advertisement for like a, an awesome carnival that's supposed to be going on. And uh, it turns out it wasn't at the square, we had to take a train. So we made our way back to the train station. Tried to find out where it was, of course, we took the wrong train, missed some trains, got lost again, the usual. So we were heading to this festival, but we kind of got a little lost on the way there. We got off at this stop, but the festival was here. We should have gotten off at this stop. And we honestly didn't think we were that far, so we started heading in that direction. It wasn't until we got here that we realized we were a lot farther than we thought we were. So we stopped here to catch our bearing. So we're here, and this leads to right here. But this leads that way, and we are facing this way. And if we're right, so we used to go that way, we would be going the correct route. It clearly says the name of the train station we need to be at. It's right there. All right, let's follow Megan. From there, we walked an additional 20 minutes to get to the festival. So after about like 25 minutes of hiking, uh, what seems like Narnia, we ran into like a hidden carnival. Sometimes. Beautiful landscaping though, like we're out in the forest, like the outskirts of Frankfurt. Deep, deep into the woods. We are, so we're gonna go in and uh, check out this fe uh, this festival and see what's up. I want some popcorn. Let's go. This don't, is don't Culinary stop. Crossings. Don't stop. Join us on our first tour through Europe with our culinary team, Jeremy, TJ, and me, Megan. The goal, travel, taste, and learn. Let's go. Switching to gear, let's go. As we climb up the hill, don't slow down. Pedal a little more. The mind is working, it's in control. Your wheels are turning a little more. Going higher and up the notch. Keep it steady, don't watch the clock go round, round. Cycle, cycle. Look at these big old vats of food. This is a lamb, yeah, beef sausage, and this is a pork sausage. And then this one's the rat Yeah. Yeah. Which one is y'all's favorite? This is the most casual one, but I don't have any favorites. So. No favorites? All of them are good, right? Yeah. I'm gonna want one of those. Cheese. The beef one or the... Through the yeah. The, um, so this is a local sausage though, right? Yeah, this is pork. Okay, pork. let's do that one then. Let's go local. Why not? Um, it's apparently the local sausage. It's pork. Um, so, I mean, I'm always down to try uh, things that have to do with where we're at. Um, so, I'm gonna try it and see how it tastes. This one? Yes. So, here you go. Thank you. Can I have that? Yeah. What did you get? Oh yeah, I got the um, the pork with the onions and the yellow and green pepper. And she has some, uh, seems like pan fried potatoes over there. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. That's good. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, that looks good. She hooked you up. Dude, check that out. So yeah, caramelized onions, uh, green, yellow peppers, seems like um, sauerkraut, a sauerkraut. You guys have any mm. for okay. the that's yeah, a, the that's a cream, the herb cream that we, that we had earlier. Oh dude, this is so good. I'm gonna sit down. Everything from the crisp casing to the even crisp bun, this is, uh, this is definitely unlike any hot dog I've ever had in my life. The taste is unreal, and the mustard, let's see, I haven't tried the mustard yet. That's excellent, I don't even know how to explain it. There's so much flavor, and then with the crispness of the casing, I can tell why it's a local favorite. Surprisingly sweet. Maybe like the herb or the rub that he uses. Does he have a glaze that he puts on it? Yeah, it's, like it's a sweet glaze. I don't know what it is. It could be a glaze. Package 
Sasha? What'd you get, Megan? I got the Schwein von Grill. I'm rotten my Don't eat fries. Don't butcher it. Don't eat fries. Yeah. It's just listen Yeah, on cabbage and bread and mustard. mustard with garlic and onions. I love it. I want this sauce. I'm not even joking. It's amazing. I've never seen this before. I've never like tried this before, and so I'm very, very excited to eat this. You don't even know the fat girl in me. It's coming out. It's coming out right. <laughs> don't go full back in. Ah, don't worry, we're hot. Yeah. Uh -huh. They seem like little, uh, like pancakes. Bellinis. Better with pancakes. Special for me. So you came up with this idea? No, I like come from Germany, yeah. Huh? Have I made this here 26 years? Oh, wow. So they're basically little pancakes covered in Nutella and powdered sugar. And you can put any toppings on it that you wanted. And that's just what I, I wanted. That's what I got. Do you have one that doesn't have Nutella? Why would I have one that doesn't have Nutella? So you can know what it actually tastes like? The the base flavor? This one right here. Oh yeah. Why would I want why would I want the base flavor? Mm. It's a pancake. That's not bad. That's actually really sweet by itself. It's a really sweet batter. You're gonna be in a wheelchair by 25. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna be happy. You're gonna be one of those Give her waffles all day and she'll be happy. You're gonna be one of those mildly obese people in Walmart no, with the, I will the not. automated wheelchair. I exercise. Exercise your jaw. It's amazing. Wonderful. Wonderful. This is uh, salmon. Oh, this wow. Is with, that's with salt. Very pink. Wow. But this, um, I don't know how to say it. Virgin have no no babies. This fish. Oh, it's virgin. Yes, it's a virgin fish. This is special from Germany. <laughs> Young and virgin. <laughs> okay, look at that one. Take a look at that. Thank you. So what is this? Salmon, a bit of tartar sauce. Are you sure that's not the herb cream sauce? No, it? he said tartar. It's tartar. Okay. I'm just gonna. It's tartar sauce. It's not tartar sauce. It is tartar sauce. He said tartar sauce. No. It's tartar sauce, right? Yeah. yeah. It's tartar sauce. It's a lot sweeter than your normal tartar sauce. Let's try it. Look at those teeth. <laughs> I got monster choppers, man. You know, guys, that's that's pretty sick, man. And all the fishes there are raw. They use like vinegar and salt to preserve it. And yeah, this this is a salt salmon. A bit of raw onion, uh, sweet sweet tar sauce, I suppose you can call it, and a roll. Yeah. Everything pretty much here in Germany, they put in a in a piece in of a bread roll, like yeah. this. Just to cut it in half. You don't find hot dog buns. You find a roll cut. A salted cured salmon. That's not bad, man. That's really good. Oh, it's not herring though. It's not herring. It's, it's raw. salmon. It's raw fish. Not my forte <laughs> at all. It's not raw fish. It's been cured and preserved. Take, take a take a bit of that salmon. Take mm. a bit of that salmon. Megan, give me some of that salmon. One bite. I'm always down to try uh, one, anything once, even though I already know I'm not gonna like it. But oh, we'll see. <laughs> Expand your taste buds, my friend. Oh, finish it, dude. You finish it. You swallow that thing. I think the tar sauce is what makes it bearable for me. If it was just the fish by itself, I'd probably be throwing it up all over camera right now. <laughs> hey, you take that back. 
That was the fakest smile ever. <laughs> These are legit potato chips, strung right from the potato in front of our faces. And I guess they baked them and they seasoned them with the salt and the pepper. Dude, ladies ain't got nothing on these. <laughs> Look at that, they like all cool. A festival ain't a festival without karaoke. Someone over there butchering American songs. Hmm. Let's go check it out. Yeah. We've had some food, now it's time to have some fun. We're gonna check out some of the rides behind us. Let's go throw up, guys. Test our, our tech skills right now. Hopefully, I don't make a fool of myself. Carnivals go hard. So up. That was not me. That was not you. That was not me. I felt it like sprinkle. I thought it was you. Look at me. That is fucking sick. That was not me. I swear to God, that was me. It has to have been you. It was that one on the other side of you. You got that on camera? Nobody threw up on me. It wasn't me. I was on the other side of you. Megan threw up on me. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell is that? That's light though, I'm still like water or something. What is I don't know, mysterious liquid. Let's do it again. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe to Culinary Crossing's YouTube page for more videos.